Our next segment highlights teens of interest in our community. Our teen on the street, Rebecca, recently caught up with Brenna Collins for our next story, Behind the Lens. Welcome to The Buzz, the segment that highlights teens of interest in our community. Today we will be interviewing Brenna Collins, who has won many awards for her photography. She recently won a $4,000 scholarship from the Los Angeles Spotlight Awards. This goes to show that there are outstanding young people everywhere in Burbank. Let's go take a look. I moved here when I was like 13, the summer from my 8th grade to freshman year. And I had like no friends. I was that chick, you know? Just locked up in my room in the dark, just kidding. But I had a computer and a really bad, like, three megapixel camera and a download of Photoshop. Like, it was on there. And it was like that kind of Photoshop that's like paint room. Like, it's not even Photoshop, but it has like five of the commands. That's all you need. And I discovered how to have fun on my own. What or who inspires you in your photography? Brooke Shaden. You can find her on Flickr. She sometimes has like little exhibits. She's like not a big famous chick, but she will be. I think up an image and then I shoot all the different things I need for it. And then I go in on Photoshop and I put it all together, blend it, add what needs to be added, and make it baller. My pictures, like photography for me is like a therapy. Like that's why I don't want to be a photographer because I'm scared it'll kind of turn into like one of those things where it's like a job, you know? So each one's like so intricately designed like to express how I'm feeling. Like I have one of me holding my own head and the title like on my Flickr is, I feel like I'm tearing myself apart right now. And if you actually like, kind of look at them, you can figure it out. Like sometimes, just for like random things, I'll just kind of go into a shoot, just because I feel like shooting a picture. But when they are specifically for something, like how I'm feeling at the time, or like just little things like that, then they take more planning. Surrealism actually helps me be able to express something rather than just making something conceptual. What did you do in the spotlight? Okay. Well, I was all pissed off because I had to like reprint my picture and stuff in class and I was I was just not okay. I was just like, no one ever wins this. It's so stupid. Whatever. And then like, 5 weeks later, I got a letter in the mail and it's like, congrats, you've been picked out of 1,500 entries in the top 15, yeah. And I was like, okay. <laughs> and then they have like an interview where you came in and you brought like four of your pictures and they made sure that you weren't like creepy. Don't know how I got past that. I'm just kidding. But yeah, they made sure that the one picture you submitted wasn't just like lucky shot. There was like this nice like little art gala in Pasadena and we all got to like, our pictures were hung up and framed and we all got to like walk around and check out the pics and stuff. And then at the very end, they called up like runners up and stuff like that. And then they were like, all right, so our top two finalists, Benito Rojas, the other guy is pretty cool. And then, me and Brim at this point, photo teacher, we're just like, there's no way in hell. Like, this is not happening. And then they're like, and Brenna Collins. And then Brum freaked out and gave me a really big hug. And then I went up there. It was awkward. <laughs> a little bit. So now you know what goes on behind the lens of talented photographer Brenna Collins. Check her out at flickr.com slash Brenna Goes Bang. Thanks for watching and tune in next time featuring another talented teen on the buzz.